Hello friends, this is Nageshwar. Welcome to my channel ITBot143. In this tutorial, I will show how to configure distributed file system in Windows Server 2003. Here I have two servers, Server 2003 running on my virtual box and Server 2K3 running on my virtual box. DFS is used to build a hierarchical view of multiple file servers and shades on the network. It allows administrators to group shared folders located on different servers by transparently connecting them to one or more DFS namespaces. So to configure distributed file system, open server, come to start, administrative tools and open distributed file system. And after opening distributed file system, just right click on distributed file system. Please select new root. Just click on next. And here, please select domain root or standalone root. Domain root will publish itself in the active directory and supports replication. Whereas in standard alone root does not, I recommend you to choose domain root next and here please type your domain name next and here it is asking for the server name browse it server one okay now it is showing the full name server one internet.com next and now it is asking for the root name I'm giving cumulative and in USC path it is added comments I'm giving cumulative share and just click on next and here we need to assign a folder to share so just click on browse so I'm using C drive and I want to make a new folder and I'm giving same name as my root okay i'm selecting cumulative okay next and here it is showing domain host server and share name and root name finish it and after creating root now let's create the links for the shares so to create links just select root and here you can find new link new root target check status filter links hide root and delete root if you want you can select from here and before creating the links create shared folders in your server so here i have created two shares data and music and also i have created in another server videos and before that i'm using virtual box so make sure that in network settings both are in same network okay i've chosen bridge adapter for both the servers okay and again please ensure that your server 1 is connected to the server 2 okay now it is successfully connected to the server 2 and after that come to the distributed file system to create a link just right click on the root and please select new link and here I'm using data in path just type server name i have created data share in server one and after that data and in comments you can type is the optional one so i'm typing data share okay and amount of time clients scheduled 
it's the referral in seconds 1800 seconds it is showing that means 30 minutes okay and one link is created and after that again to create a new link again come to new link I've created one more share music in server 1 music share okay I'm creating a link for my server to share in server 2 I have shared videos folder and this is server 2 and followed by the shared folder name video share if everything perfect if you click the ok it will create the link and if you type incorrectly it will show the error ok so now it is successfully created the link for the shared folder in server 2 and after this just open the computer and in address bar just type server 1 and I've created cumulative share okay and here you can find data from server 1 music 1 server 1 and videos from the server 2 that means it will show all the shades one place and after that I can come to the distributed file system and please select the root right click and come to properties open publish and here it is showing the internet dot cumulative share okay and come to publish and please select publish this root in active directory and here it is showing the path to the DFS root and description you can type anything and please assign the owner for this route and if you want to give any key words for this share so just click on edit and in my share I have data files music and videos okay these three kind of shares are in the cumulative share so in keywords I have typed data music videos and after that just click on ok now it is showing the keywords data music videos apply ok like this we can create a distributed file system with this I have successfully completed distributed file system in Windows Server 2003 I hope this video will help you in creating the distributed file system if you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel ITBird 143 to watch more latest uploaded videos thank you friends have a nice day